I didn't think I was going to cry. We're just getting started. <laughs> I cried earlier already. <laughs> 17 years, Aww, three months, so four days. But who's really counting? That's when 11 year old me asked you to be my girlfriend through a message on AOL and some messenger. You see the stars As we stand here surrounded by joy and love, I can't help but think back to the day when you asked me to be your girlfriend. I was sitting in my room on my Razor flip phone. I logged on to AIM and waited for your name to pop up. And once your name popped up, I got butterflies. We started our normal conversation, then you popped the question in the chat. Will you be my girlfriend? I basically slid into your DMs before it was even a thing yet. Regardless of how much time has passed, it's always been you. You've been my best friend for as long as I can remember, and you've played a big part in me becoming the man that I am today. Thank you for being the hardest working, family oriented, and selfless person I know. We're surrounded by all our loved ones in a different country, and they're all here to see us tie the knot. As I always have, I will love you from this moment until my very last. Ever since we were 12 years old, you have been the only boy I have ever loved. You have been my best friend and partner in crime for the last 17 years. Back then, we didn't have unlimited text, so every text sent back and forth cost 10 cents. At the end of the month, my mom got a phone bill of $1,000, and it was because of this boy right here. Today, I give you my heart once again, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Oh, my husband. It's like almost 31 years ago. The reason why we decided to do a destination wedding is because we value our family and friends, and we want to be able to make sure that we experience everything and have a lot of moments together. Love you! Tell Mike, welcome to the family, but he's already been a part of the family. You really are like a big brother to me. He's not at all what I thought he would be. He's quiet, but not when it comes to karaoke. All of a sudden, he turns into Pluto Mars, dude. He just is so selfless, and he's always taking care of me. The way he takes care of me, that's how I know he takes care of Isa a thousand times better.
together with my amazing sister, Krizia. We shared countless memories, secrets, and dreams. We laughed and we cried and we stood by each other through every challenge that we had. And I wouldn't be where I am now if it wasn't for you pushing me to follow my dreams. I knew we had a bond in our last lifetime, but we all knew that she would be getting married before I was. I told myself, if Isa and Mike break up, then love doesn't exist. You've been together for more than half of my life. Now, here we are in Cancun, celebrating your love for one another. because I know that you both complement each other. You both bring out the best in each other and are there through thick and thin. To the Pudos! I like your energy. He's getting married in one hour. Can we get five shots, please? For real? Each. Each. <laughs> Janda? <laughs> oh my god, what if I fall? That's the longest shit walk, bro. We're gonna bring water. Oh, we've been drinking all this whole time. I'm sorry. <laughs> Stop looking at my butt crack, guys. What the fuck? We got tequila tears right. Time. Yeah. <laughs> Side, though, so I'll turn over here. <laughs> Can I get a wheelchair? Yo, you I'm crying now. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not crying anymore. Good. I'm done. That's good. Mm -hmm. Goodbye.